So, what is this? Like another elevator? They'll figure it out. Please do stand back, Guardian of Galaxies. Whoa! What magnificent witchcraft is this? I know! It's like they've never seen a giant transdimensional hand before. Please do step in ball. What if things go sideways? How do we get back? With passport. Can communicate with Cosmo, and if emergency, bring Guardian of Galaxies back. I would. Better you take it than Captain Valor over here. His time. Investigate Nova ship. Use passport to report findings. And you'll speak to the world mind? Get rid of that fine, right? Those won't do best. Good luck, Guardian of Galaxies. Anyone see any seatbelts? You better not throw up this time. This is... Sorcery? I was going to say dizzying. I am good. You get used to it. Are we in space? We're somewhere between space, between dimensions, between time, between uh, realities even. What do you mean, between? We could theoretically go wherever and whenever with this thing. Even the places that don't exist, but uh, do. It's incredible. What kind of name is Avengers? Is that sound normal? <laughs> normal? You ain't heard nothing yet. Oh, Pat Benatar and John Jet watch over us. Who are these gods you speak of? Goddesses. <laughs> uh, Drax? <laughs> I am not the one laughing. It is obviously an ill omen of our impending deaths. Or it's an alternate reality. <laughs> I know that sound. I am proud of Definitely an alternate reality. Hey, look! It's Spider Man! Wait, is that Earth? Peter. Mom? Come on, you're dating for the promise here. Come on in, Janie. Peter will be up in a second. Really? Janie? Okay, next stop, Alice Hope. Probably. Hold on, group. Here we go. <gasps> Flark and Halla! Okay, here we go! Whoa, no, Flark! You guys okay? Do we look okay? Well, hang in there. I'll try to restore gravity. Oh, great. We're gonna be stuck like this forever. Rocket, buddy, what am I looking for? Drax, tell Scut Lord most ships use external power conduits to generate pseudo gravity in hyperbaric airlocks. The beast says to find a power conduit. Right, and what do those look like? Might be just what we need. Then pick it up already. All right, I'll have you guys on solid ground in a tick. Found some kind of battery. Looks undamaged. Could be useful. Someone tell Scott Lord to hold on to it. Hold on to it, Peter Quill. I'm not seeing anything useful. Somebody tell him I ain't gonna do all his work for him. Use your visor, Peter. Something terrible happened here. What gave it away? The lack of gravity or the general destruction? Both are undeniable. Okay, I got the battery installed, Gamora, but nothing's happening. Seriously? Uh, fine. I'll tell them. Listen up, slug breath. Tell me what you see. Uh, there's a blue wire and two connections, yellow and red. And one big green thing. Don't touch the green thing! Not a great time to start yelling, dude! Okay. Okay. First, plug the wire to either connection. All we need is a little jump start. To either one? It's not brain surgery, just pick one. I have begun. Uh, here goes nothing! Oh, crap! Everybody, just hold on! Oh, no. ah. Ah. 
Gravity was not restored. You had one job, Quill. I did exactly what. <sighs> Impressive, Peter Quill. I didn't know you could do that. Neither did I. Those firearms are becoming quite formidable. Second time they've transformed like that. Third. If that was the third time, when was the first? The day I was kidnapped. When my mom died. We should continue our investigation for the dog. We'll need to get this wreckage out of the way first. Groot's right. Should move if we give it a jolt. Big red chumps you touch. Should we call Cosmo? Let him know what we found so far. What do you mean a code word? Fine. Brood won't call the mud until we all agree on a code word. Could be useful if we get cornered by whatever's on the ship. How about Quill Kill? Not covert enough. Must be something said in everyday conversation. Ooh, oh! The code word? is Ride the Stars. And we should hold off calling Cosmo until we figure out what's going on. We should also standardize our use of the term dog report item to distinguish information of interest to our investigation. Yep. Sure thing, buddy. Dog report item. Something caused Novacore to abandon the ship. Maybe they all just quit. Some people don't give up when things start going wrong. Was that a crack? No, it was a pointed criticism. I am Groot. Guys, Rocket left, but he's back now. That's all that matters. This is the only way out, but the door's got no juice. Must be on a different circuit. That'll do it. Why does that keep happening? There, you all felt that, right? Yep. The same thing happened when I tried to restore the gravity. Looks just like what happened on the rock. Indeed. It was a desperate attempt at a last defensive position. Good bottleneck for it. If this was a fight, then where are all the bodies? Good point. There weren't any in the evacuation hangar either. Maybe everyone escaped. I wouldn't get your hopes up, Peter. Okay, we need to get to Corell's office. Someone tell Quill. Come on, dude. Can't we just talk to each other? Fine. You do know your girlfriend probably didn't make it. Oh, you are just being spiteful. Still nothing but emergency power. Knew this would come in handy. Where'd you get a Nova passkey? Nikki gave it to me, to keep it away from her mom. We could sell that. It must be worth a couple thousand units. Do you know what Nova Corps does to people who steal from them? <laughs> Look around. How much you want to bet there aren't enough Nova left to execute us? I doubt even Perhaps you could Lady break Elvin that. A worthy He's to devour us. Oh yeah? And how would she know we were here? Nikki had all kinds of secret passageways on the ship. Maybe she left a message or something. You are fond of this girl. I, I guess. I mean, we actually had a lot in common. Kind of reminded me of me, you know? I do not know. Uh, it doesn't matter. I just want to make sure her and her mom are okay. Now we're 
exploring maintenance tunnels. It can't hurt, can it? Better we check than miss something. This place don't look too safe is all. I knew the layout of this tub better. Then we could figure out where this started. You know where we are, Gamora? Not really. Anova never really let me out of their sight. They had good reason not to trust you. This again? I was only stating that Nova's position of not trusting you was accurate. At the time. Here's the deal. We figure out what is going on here, and then we can figure out how to work better together. So, just ignore the obvious while it's inconvenient? Yes. First thing we do when we get back on the Milano is have a big talk. Pinky swear. No wonder we've been stumbling around in the dark. Whoa, ho, ho, look at you, you sexy beast. Stop flirting, Rocket. Is it supposed to be upside down? Eh, only if you wanted to channel all the ship's power up through the ceiling. Makes no sense to me. There must be a reason, a bad one. Try that console. Uh, we can use this to re-invert the core, or, uh, uh de-invert, uh, de de-vert? Rocket. Uh, the console's safety locked because the mounting arms are retracted. If we can pop them out of them side panels, we can flip the core. Well, stop flarking around. It ain't gonna work without the arms. Huh. Looks like the arms are stuck without any power. I bet we could jumpstart them. How? Gotta be a power cell somewhere. There's gotta be more machinery up there. Gamora, give me a boost! Of course! <laughs> Definitely something up here! Hell yeah, it worked! You know, them guns would make better engineering tools than weapons. Nice try. Let's get the other one free. Groot, give me a lift. Right Groot says no. All right, Gamora, let's get the second one done. Okay. We can... Oh, Scott! Guys! We've got incoming! Yeah, there's more of them infected freaks! Man, I was hoping we'd find Nova Core here, but not like this! Now we know who inverted the core! But why? I will deal with these fools! Continue with your investigation! No! Bad idea! Deal with the murder squad first! Cut to pieces! Yeah! Just try not to get shot by the big guns, bud! Bust out the smart bombs! Some of these guys got upgrades, huh? Finally! They're speaking my language! I hope we didn't fight alongside any of these guys in the war! We'll make sure they get a harass! Oh, 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 slice him up! Feel this? Definitely not the Nova Corps I was hoping to find here! See a stupid helmet? Shoot a stupid helmet! Did you notice the rumbling stuff when we flipped the reactor away from the ceiling? We must find a way up there and discover why, for the dog report. Rocket, what's that console telling you? That you should come do the honors. Okay. 
surprise! This whole thing's a lift. We can ride it all the way up there. I guess Nova grunts and grease monkeys don't get the cool flying suits. Typical. Nobody respects their engineers these days. If you want efficiency, you gotta make... Whoa! Flark! Flarking clamps! They're shutting us down! More freaks approach! Flarkers de-re-inverted the core again! We'll just have to re de re it back! After we take some heads! <laughs> Peter! I will enjoy this! so we can keep moving. I will tear them from their sockets. Ain't gonna work, Musclehead. But this time, we've got a control room to play with. Looks like I can remove the clamps from here. Good. We will not be stopped by clamps. Gah! Sneaky dash bags. They scrambled the power circuit, so I can't release them. I grow tired of these clamps. Gonna have to reroute the circuits one by one to reset the power grid. Here, I'll get the door for you. You should be able to see the grid with your visor. Okay, visor's up. Now what? You should see power grids along the walls around here. Find their powered up nodes. Looking for glowy power nodes. Right. When you find them, you need to electrify the junction switch in the direction you want the power to flow. Shoot them with electricity? Yeah. We're aiming for big glowing lines routing back towards the clamps in the middle. Looks like the wall's weak here. Drax, I need a hole here to reach the grid. Then you will have one. Did that do anything? Not yet. You'll have to reroute a couple of them. What does Talos Hope do, anyways? Groot, I think I have an idea. Use your roots to raise that platform with me on it. Kind of a root root boost thing. <laughs> Neat trick. Groot loves being helpful. He's always helpful. Perhaps the Nova Killer knows how to redirect these machines. She has experience. I was an assassin, not a saboteur. Same results either way, right? Would you rather paint with a paintbrush or a mop? Neither. I use explosives. Somebody else does the mop. Right about there.
One more time, Groot. I am Groot. That's good. Gamora, think you can lift this panel with me on it? How about no? Up we go. So any guesses on what they're doing with all that power? I see it now. You've got half of it rerouted. Now work on the other room. Okay, I'm getting the hang of this. Might be gunning for your job soon. You want to trade? I'm happy to sit in the captain's seat. You frequently sit in the captain's seat. I did not just hear that. That's got to be one of the power nodes. Just need to reroute it. You know, normally you're not supposed to travel through dimensions without a quarantine and a decompression on the other side. Group, need your help, buddy. Group boost, please. Everybody stay alert. Quill has a knack for pushing the wrong buttons or crossing the wrong wire. Small hairy ones insinuating you are bad luck. Funny how the small hairy one is always right there guiding me. Peter Quill is insinuating that you will be so you can cause the problem. Hurry up, Quill. Buffy's bugging everybody with his color commentary. Okay! I bet I can reroute the power to get myself back out of here! Solid plan! Ah. That's another power node. Oh! Hey there! Anyone else feeling ready to move on? Yep, and do it. Looks like you did it, Star Pants. Now get into the control room and hit that clamp release. I'll re-re-invert the core at the same time and get us moving again. Huh. Well, I think you had it right the first time. A Groot in Novacorp. Yeah, right. It would have been possible. They try to recruit Corman from any world in good standing. Well, too bad. Groot's the last one, and he's too smart to ever sign up with them scuttles. Doors open, and I got the power flowing through. Almost qualified to be a junior engineer. Thanks. I am Groot. Groot's right. Maybe we should just call Cosmo, tell him we tried, and port the Flark out of here. It ain't our fault Scut was locked down. We will not fail at our mission. I mean, that sounds great and all, but we usually fail at our missions. Not this time. Our work here is important. The clamps are unclamped. Slick. Now get back in here before we leave you behind. Yeah, let's see how far you get without your button pusher. This would go a lot faster if we all had the ability to scan. Now that we know the infected Nova are here, we can agree that whatever's going on upstairs is really bad, right? They were furious when we removed their power source. It must be important to their effort here. Can't wait to smash it. Whatever it is. All right, this is our floor. These doors are sealed tight. Just look for another way out. Gamora, can you pry that thing open for us? And bend my sword? Nope. Drax, hit that panel where all the wires connect. <laughs> Step aside. Come out to the coast. We'll get together, have a few laughs. What's that? Uh, nothing. No, that. They must have flipped the core back. Something's powering up again. Great. Now we're stuck in the ventilation. Great job, Quill. 
Dude, I know you're peeved, and I'm sorry. Apology accepted. Really? That's it? In case you hadn't noticed, there's more important things happening right now than Quilt saying he's sorry. Whoa! Flark and Scott! What are these frackling gaboons doing to Contraxia? What is this thing, Rocket? I don't know! Looks like it's siphoning something! Something to do with those cubes? No, no! I gotta get a closer look! Peter Quill, we have been in this hangar before! It is. What the flark? I am Groot. Corral would never have allowed this to happen to her ship. So you think she escaped? I don't know. She could be holed up in her office. I am Groot. We're not leaving till we find out what happened. Dog report item. Massive device siphoning energy from Contraxia. Don't forget the energy cubes. Dog report item. Energy stored in strange cubes. Groot! We need to check out that giant ray thing! Can you get us across? Dog report item! We gotta destroy this thing! We don't even know what it is! Plus, we'd probably end up taking out the entire ship! Let's avoid the scary beam! Good advice! Guardian of Galaxies, Cosmo Jack. Investigation lead him to believe Halo is key to Galaxy Mystery. What is that noise? We are compiling an extensive dog report. Ah, flark the report! Tell him his magic hand almost got us killed! Contraxia isn't looking so good. They're killing it is what they're doing. Tell Cosmo what is happening. They've got this giant ray thing he pointed at the planet. It's collecting some kind of... Uh-oh. What is... Uh-oh, Piotr Quill? Something just came up. We'll call you back. Your experience fighting Centurions will be necessary here, woman. Spread out! We're gonna need a strategy to take them out! They will all be destroyed! Time to shred them! Do your thing, Drax! You flattenards are gonna pay for whatever you're doing to Contraxia! Your voice is annoying, Ben! Keep it up! Get down here! Let me shoot you! Brutify him, Drew! Drax, toss it! Get the point! I wondered how we would fare against the Centurion. More jabbing, less jibber jabbing. I'm living out so many revenge fantasies right now. You shouldn't be enjoying this, Rocket. Slice and dice. I'm on it. Prepare for pain. Shoot the energy discs on their chest. They're too sparking. And on the ground as well. Got one of the worked out space cops. Way to knock some sense into us. Make your peace. Precision is key here, guys. My plan is to blast them. My guy keeps dodging my shots. As one, it's a simple. They are Nova, not anymore, anywhere. Death has come. 
Mitsu! You see that gold anywhere? About Yato? We ain't talking our way out of this one, Quell. Drop it! Drop them off, bud! They must be vulnerable to certain tactics! Most of them ain't too keen on getting a blast as Rukum death! Drop it down! This would be a worthy battle! The Trinians have a lot of tricks up their sleeves! You one day have to shoot it out with Nova Corps! I have met a few who are respectable. These are not them! I hope they're disconnected from the world mine! Yes! The last thing we need is more of them going up! You don't stand a chance! With pleasure! Been too long since I blow something up! Hey, it seems to me like this ship might be ground zero for whatever's happening. We gotta find Corral, get some real answers. You have any idea where she is? I'm thinking we check her office. You know a way out of the hangar? Yeah, same way me and Nikki went last time we were here. You know, we never did talk about why you jumped after her, Peter. Uh, because it was the right thing to do. We should hurry. More zealots could arrive at any moment. The hole we saw should be on the other side of these moving batteries. Gonna need to find a way to stop them. Start looking around. Rocket, can you see where that vent leads? Anything to get out of here. We should be prepared in case the beast tries to destroy this machine. There you go. I've done my part. Yeah, thanks. We still need a way through. We need to get out of here. Huh, that ain't right. Drax, I'm gonna need you to drag this over. I will assume you have a plan. There must be something we have not found. Ah, I see what you are thinking, Peter Quill. We can use the train to grab the battery. Uh, right. Just like I planned. Just like I thought. Impressive work, Peter Quill. I just hope it does not cause an explosion. Well, let's not stick around to find out. All right. Come on, the tunnel's just past here. We got lucky no one else showed up. The Unifier has detected an intrusion. Spread out. It will be contained. By, by her, her will. will. Move! There's too many of them. In the hole! Jump! Still don't get why you jumped after the kid back then. Top 10 dumbest things I ever saw you do. You should have seen how worried he was. Hey! Star Pants was our ticket with the captain. I was worried his death would lead to more jail time. It was adorable. I hate you all. <sighs> You do it. Nope. Okay, group. I think I know my way around. We just need to get into the tunnels on the other side there. Pretty sure this is right. Pretty sure? Everything was on fire last time. I couldn't make that happen. No, no. Rocket, no! Ain't that a piece of the Unifier's old ship? Unifier. Yeah, whatever. When we were arrested, they mentioned Raker got caught for the same thing we did. Not exactly the same. He got caught scavenging in the quarantine zone. Forget Raker. Our focus right now is finding Nikki. Your focus? My focus is not dying on this stupid ship. The dog wants us to find Centurion Corel. Right, so we're multitasking. I did not realize you and the girl fell down so far, Peter Quill. I didn't fall. I jumped. Heroically. One more time, group. Let's go find Corel and Nikki. Sorry. 
So, we all agree that the captain and her kid are probably dead, right? Corral survived the worst of the war. And a relationship with Peter. Still willing to bet they didn't survive this. You'd wager on whether or not a mother and child are dead. Nikki's one of the most resourceful kids I ever met, and Corral's a warrior. I'd bet on both of them any day of the week. Be careful down there, Peter Quill. Yeah, definitely a lot sparkier than last time. Uh, make sure the kid ain't floating face up somewhere. That'll work. What do you say, Gamora, now that the floor can't kill us? I say, no problem. Well, definitely no sign of Nikki or Corel. I mean, I guess that's good news. Whoa, watch out! You okay? Groot says we should start thinking about exit plans. <laughs> The exit plan is to call Cosmo after we get the answers we need. Answers you need, maybe. It does not strike me as very safe here, Peter Quill. Better this than getting shot at. Eh, speak for yourself. You'd rather get shot at? More fulfilling to shoot someone I don't like than look for someone I don't care about. Our leader seems to care, and so we should also pretend to care. Careful, Peter Quill. Okay, don't remember this green gas being here last time. I think you mean deadly green gas. This whole ship's a death trap now. I'm sure there's a way to unburst these pipes. There better be, because there's no way I'm walking through that. There, breezy peasy. Okay, that was bad, even for you. Ah, more death gas. Maybe Nikki and Corral are using it to protect themselves. Or, and hear me out on this, maybe they're dead. You know what, man? You're being a real jackass, like, way more than usual. Tension is palpable. Oh, can you both please just get over this? Agreed. Either resolve your issues or fight to the death. Look, Rocket, I know I suck sometimes. We all suck sometimes. Pretty sure it's why we ended up together. I do not suck. Point is, they care about us. But right now, we're not the ones in danger. And Nikki's just a kid, man. As long as we're clear on the you sucking part. Clear as day. Here! This is definitely the right way. Nikki's secret hideout is just through here. Thought we were going to the captain's office. We are. Right after we check here. Try not to break anything. This place means a lot to her. Oh, wow. Didn't Nikki paint all this? Pretty cool, right? Nikki? Little one, reveal yourself. Maybe try being a little less scary. It's Peter! The... the pirate? Nikki! We do not intend to kill you! We need to get into that room. Gamora, you wanna try something? No way! I'm thinking... Drax. Absolutely not. Groot, you're up! I am Groot. He ain't doing it. Rocket, you got the body of a little girl. Can you fit in there? Try again, Quill. Ask him nicely, Peter. I'm concerned for Nikki's safety, okay? I'm worried she might be hurt or scared or... I don't know what. Can you please see if she's in there? See? Was that so hard? I don't see no kid. Careful, Peter Quill. In my experience, children often booby-trap their toys. It's not Nikki's, it's mine. So we're just claiming her stuff now? Because if we are... No, I mean it literally used to belong to me. Uh, Quill, you gotta see this. This kid's obsessed with you. Wait, why does she have your toy? 
It's just something I gave to Corel when we were together during the war, like a keepsake. It doesn't mean anything. Does, uh, this mean anything? How old is the child? Twelve. Ha! Congratulations, Peter Quill! You will make a terrible father. Unless the child is dead, in which case, does not matter. W wait Is this why you dragged us here? Clearly. The child is twelve, and Quill was with the child's mother twelve years ago. The math is irrefutable. Yes, okay. So the dates maybe kind of match up, so it's possible, I guess. As long as they had a health class on this. Inspiring. Can we just focus on if Corell and Nikki are okay? They're clearly not here, so let's move on and keep looking. Anyone else feel weird going through Nikki's stuff like this? Peter Quill is her father. It is his duty to pry into her personal life. Pretty sure she ain't here, Quill. For all we know, maybe this guy's her dad. Yeesh. Looks like an even bigger deadbeat than you. Still can't get over how good she is with all this tech stuff. Meh, I could do better. Yeah, but she's 12. Guess Nikki wasn't much of a Skrull fan. Name someone who is a Skrull fan. <laughs> good point. Staring at it ain't gonna change what it says. It doesn't say anything. It's just some confused kid projecting stuff. I'm thinking Nikki won't mind if we use this. What do you say, Rocket? I say I don't care even if she does mind. Okay, where were we? Congratulating you on being a father. <laughs> 